Hi, I'm Ewan Camp from Mirror Video, and today I'm reporting from suburbia. This peaceful and quiet, pleasant land. Oh, <laughs> say, God, let's go again. Hi, I'm Ewan Camp from Mirror Video, and today I'm in suburbia. Now, I want to get really under the skin of what. Me Emmett Drive, um, you want to take a left down here, straight on, and you get to the roundabout, uh, take another right, uh, past the petrol garage, keep going. Hi, I'm Ewan Camp from Arrow Video, and on this glorious day, I'm here in suburbia. Now, suburbia is a fascinating place, but don't take it from me. Let's meet some of the people and hear what they have to say about their life in suburbia. Oh, well, look, here's one of them now. How fortunate. Uh, Sir, so if I can just... Um, have, um, all right, all right, all right, go, go, get the camera, go, go, go. Get to the car, get to the car, come on, come on, come on. Where's the car keys? Get the car keys out, come on. Okay, so the location shooting didn't quite work out, so we've decided to come where it's nice and warm and most importantly dry, here at Arrow HQ. I'm Ewan from Arrow Video, and uh, I'm producing our upcoming Blu-ray release of The Burbs. And I'm here today to tell you about all the special features that are going to be included on our release. Um, this is a Blu-ray world premiere for the Burbs, and to that end we've spared no expense in restoring the film in 2K resolution for your viewing pleasure. Here's a quick clip for you to see. Oh, he's, he's busy now. He's, he's not busy. Now look, he's going into go now because if, I mean, he's going back in. If you were, if you were going to say hi, you should probably. There, he's going into the hut. You, you're going to lose him because he's, he's going to go in. Well, there, now you've blown it, haven't you? No, I didn't blow it. He, chicken. Went, he went into his house. Chicken? I'm not chicken because he went into his house. Well, he went into his... You know, you look like a chicken in front of your son and everything. Your son. So, the stuff that you already know about. Well, there's the uh, audio commentary with screenwriter Dana Olsen. There's the massive feature-length documentary on the making of the verbs called There Goes the Neighbourhood, which comes from our friends at High Rising Productions. And that includes interviews with actress Wendy Schall, director Joe Dante, uh, Courtney Gaines, who plays the young Klobeck, and we've even got Corey Feldman in there. Here's a quick look at that making of Doc. Well, I have had a few instances where people have been confused about uh, the tone of the movies that I've done. And uh, the quote that I remember most is, is this a horror movie or a comedy? Um, and there's, of course, no reason why it can't be both. But uh, it, some people think very linearly, and um, on occasion uh, there's been some confusion as to what exactly I'm trying to do. Uh, in this case, it was even though the picture is, you know, nominally a sort of a horror comedy, it's a comedy, and and the ad, which never changed, was was very clever. It was just Tom Hanks with a fly swatter and a hose, and as if he in his pajamas, as if he's out in the backyard, you know, uh, trying to catch thieves or something. And uh, that that well, I I believe everywhere in the world that was the ad, uh, and it and it was the right ad, and it obviously worked. Well, here's the really exciting news. We're going to be including the full work print cut of the movie. Uh, this has come from Joe Dante, transferred from his personal VHS, which means that you'll be able to see scenes like this. And this. Ray Peterson! Ah, there you are, Ray. And this. To show you some of the main differences between the work print version of the film and the theatrical version, we've included a handy video featurette uh, which compares differences between the two. Uh, it includes some of the deleted scenes, it compares different cuts of different sequences, and that also comes with uh, an audio commentary from Joe Dante, who again was very gracious enough to assist us with that. This, this scene is snappier, it's funnier, it's got... Uh, it's got better jokes in it and uh, you know Rick stealing everything from the house um, it, whereas the other scene is a bit more expositiony and uh, we we felt it was kind of flat so we asked the Universal if we could uh, shoot something else and they uh, they said yes so what else do we have uh, we've got the alternate ending um, this was already included on the US DVD uh, but this is the first time you'll be seeing it in full HD this ending is similar to the ending of the work print with some minor but very important differences. So, find out what those are. You're going to have to get the disc, I'm afraid. So, what else have we got? Well, of course, we've got all the good stuff that you've come to expect from an Arrow video release. We have the reversible sleeve. On the one side, we've got the stunning new artwork, which you can see here, from Graham Humphreys. 
And of course, we've got on the other side, uh, the theatrical poster, um, the iconic image of Tom Hanks in his dressing gown uh, with a fly swap, which uh, I attempted to recreate earlier without much success, I'm afraid. We've also got an uh, information-packed collector's booklet, which comes with the disc. Uh, that features the lead article on uh, the birds, and it also includes an archival um, piece about the cinematic collaborations between Joe Dante and composer Jerry Goldsmith. So that's it for my Burbs Extra Features Roundup. Um, we're having a lot of fun putting it together for you guys, and we can't wait for you to get your hands on it and hear what you think about it. I'll be right back.